hello everyone welcome to geeker mag in today's video i'm going to share a quick solution using which you can easily deal with chat gpt error message that is you have hit the free plan limit for gpt 4o before that i'm trying to hit 20,000 subscribers on youtube please consider subscribing to the channel as this encourages me in creating more similar videos well legally there is no way to bypass or get rid of this error message because company offers limited prompts or responses when chat gpt is using GPT 4O model. After that, it switched to older version of GPT. So the question is how to keep using GPT 4O for your work or whatever needs you need to fulfill. Answer to this question is Microsoft Copilot, which is backed by GPT 4O and it can perform all the actions that chat GPT can do. And the good thing is it's free. In Windows operating system, the app comes pre-installed. In case you are not using the Windows PC, then Microsoft Copilot also have web app as well. Both of them share same UI. For this tutorial, I'll show you how you can use Microsoft Copilot on web. First, let's move on to ChatGPT website and type a prompt so that we can compare it with Microsoft Copilot. Let's ask ChatGPT to create an image with this prompt. So we get a beautiful image matching our description, right? Let's head over to Microsoft Copilot website and type the same prompt. And again, there is a beautiful image matching our description. Although results may vary, but quality of the final result will match according to what kind of prompt you have added. Let's type another prompt in ChatGPT. This time we'll ask to identify information in the image. Let's upload this image. And in no second, we get information about what inside the image. Now we move on to Microsoft Copilot and upload same image with same prompt. And again, Copilot didn't disappoint and give the exact same information. Just like that, you can perform all the actions in Microsoft Copilot until your chat GPT daily limit reset. Microsoft Copilot is a great way to deal with error on which this whole video is based without paying anything. I hope this helps. If you want me to cover tips like the one covered in this video, then feel free to share in the comments. Also, if you find this video useful, then don't forget to like this video and subscribe the channel to get notifications about more similar videos. Thanks for watching.